السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله my brothers my sisters today is a beautiful day of Friday and uh, coming from Lagos Nigeria uh, subhanallah I believe this is my second time here after so many years and alhamdulillah we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala I thought I would talk about this because it is absolutely important that we just kind of always remember this thing I am about to talk about and uh, in a way that it strengthens us and it grants us hope and it uh, keeps us moving. My brothers, my sisters, whatever you do in life, whatever you do in life, before you think about anyone or anything, always remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah comes first. And whatever you do between you and Allah, always be after the pleasure of Allah. Read Allah. You know the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Read Allah, not read the nas. Read Allah, not read the nas. Because if read the nas is your goal, wallahi, you can never ever satisfy the need, or oh, sorry, the pleasure of man. You can never make them happy completely. But when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the one you are trying to please, subhanallah, you would definitely get that. How is it? You would try your best, you would do whatever you can. Between you and Allah, your heart is pure, your intention is good and clean. But nobody sees that. Everybody sees, oh, mashallah, he's trying to do this, he's trying to do that. Okay, he's trying to do this and that. Oh, my brothers, my sisters, forget about what people think about you. For as long as you and Allah know that what you are doing is correct, sincere, true. My brothers, my sisters, people can write books. They can publish newspapers. They can publish uh, journals. They can publish diaries. They can publish whatever articles. I don't know, whatever they want to do. Forget about them. Allah is happy with you. You've won, man. You've won. Allah is not happy with you. You failed hands down, my brother, my sister. Subhanallah, subhanallah. So let's try our best to ensure that whatever we do, just that we want to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And even if the people are trying to say this and that about us, my brother, you know, be, 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 be focused and determined and keep moving keep moving keep moving the moment you begin to deviate from being focused on what you're doing and you're trying to listen to what they say and what she's saying what he's saying what they are commenting and what they're not not commenting you're losing focus and you won't achieve a lot you won't achieve a lot let them keep saying let them keep talking and you keep doing the work let them keep talking and you keep doing the work maybe by them talking who knows they may be even getting insane depending on what they are saying if they are sincerely trying to say one or two things about what you are doing in a correct in a true sincere way mashallah, perhaps it, we could listen to that but if they are trying to just criticize you and just look at every fault nitpick and do what forget about them keep doing your work keep going keep swimming Subhanallah, keep going. MashaAllah. I just recalled uh, one of uh, the meetings I had, and uh, you know, the, the advice I was told, you know, keep swimming. Subhanallah. So keep going, keep going. And, and don't, don't allow them distract you, don't allow them make you lose focus. Don't do that. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us strength, my brothers, my sisters. I know some people are really uh, affected by comments, especially negative ones. If you are from among those, uh, inshallah, Allah make it easy for you. But don't let it kind of, you know, affect you in a way that you don't want to carry on with your work. No, you are not supposed to do that, my brother, my sister. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to bless us, to strengthen us, to grant us that, you know, success. فَاسْتَبِقُوا khairat, You know, hasten, rush, you know, race towards goodness. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. It's absolutely amazing. Be focused. Just keep going. Keep trying. Keep going. Keep trying. Subhanallah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala really accept from us all the good work we do. 
Don't bother. Let them say, I do subhanallah. Let them just say what they want. A day will come, they will realize the, the, the bad they were doing and the wrong they were saying, and they would stop. And even if they don't stop, it's okay. Allah is happy with you, thumbs up. Allah is not happy with you, thumbs down. It's a problem. So my brothers, my sisters, barakallahu fikum, be strong, keep trying, keep going, uh, keep pushing, keep, keep, keep trying your best. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, be, be, be very prayerful. Always make your du'as, be very, very prayerful. And see how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would surely assist you. He would surely protect you. I know the evil eyes, there, etc. But with the help of Allah, in the name of Allah, by which nothing on the earth or on the skies can affect you, He is the most hearing, the most knowing. Keep making dua and be strong. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will definitely grant you success, my brothers, my sisters. Today is a beautiful day of Friday. I thought we could talk about this uh, because it's absolutely important. Every time I see that the urge by people to say bad things and to to comment negatively not necessarily about myself although myself too included and everyone else no don't be disturbed keep trying keep going and keep be trying your best and be prayerful may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make it easy barakallahu fikum jazakumullah khair aqulu qawli hadha wa sallallahu sallam wa baraka ala nabina muhammad subhanak allahumma rabbana wa bihamdik ashhadu an la ilaha illa anta astaghfiruka wa atubu ilaik wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi Wabarakatuh.